two plays for this one, but of course one I like more than the other. I'll tell you which one that is in a second. First of all, for the full game side bet, the Bulls have been one of the stronger teams in the Eastern Conference this season. In addition to Vucevic, they added Lonzo Ball and DeMar DeRozan in a complete overhaul of their roster. Franz Wagner, the NBA's second highest scoring rookie at 15.7 points per game, had six fourth quarter points as the Magic rallied in the final three minutes in a win over an excellent Mavs team. Although the Magic have won only 11 games, their future looks promising with Suggs and Wagner commanding the backcourt. They may not be able to knock off the best teams, but they will keep it close. Orlando is 5-1 ATS in their last six games facing Eastern Conference opponents. And for that, we will take the Orlando Magic in this one. But I'm fancying the total. Chicago ranks 14th in pace heading into this home tilt with the Magic. They will be without their primary ball handler in Lorenzo Ball, Lonzo Ball, sorry, for the next month as he recovers from injury. Further, Alex Caruso will be out indefinitely after having wrist surgery earlier this month. They would be best served to employ a more conservative pace over the next few weeks as they recover from injury. Also, for some reason, Magic and Bulls games typically go under. The total number has gone under in a whopping 17 out of 20 games between these two clubs. So with that, <clears throat> my, be my better play is to go with the under in this one. So if you're feeling brave, go Orlando and under. If not, just take the under. That's what I'm doing. What say you? Let me know in the comment section below. As always, good luck to you. May the winner be yours. Taylor Fade. Go get him. This is Training Rabbit.